Listen, man, Sabo just got the flare flare fruit and he's already holding off an admiral. And he has the, the right mind to use like a physical object with it. I, is he using it better than Ace ever did? Not yet, but I think he sees the potential, man. But guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus. I won't have any more Ace slander around here today. And we're back in Dressrosa. The last two ending with, like, like I said, Sabo sort of going toe to toe with Fujitora, the admiral, while Luffy is still just gung-ho headed for doflamingo we're gonna hop right into these two if you're new to the channel make sure you drop a subscription it is free here on youtube and let's get started Moosey. i love how moosey is known as the grim reaper oh wait Oh, this was whenever Luffy ballooned. I, dude, the, following like, the timeline of the events in Dress Rosa, Rosa is kind of confusing sometimes because, like, stuff gets replays a lot. They're all petrified of Moosey. Why are you guys still here? There has to be, like, a writing reason for them to be here, aside from the joke that Luffy doesn't want them there. Oh. Cavendish! How did he get in front of them? I like the sparkles. Oh, I guess he has the horse. That kind of makes sense. That the horse would be faster than Moosey. He has a mic? You can't not love Cavendish, bro. Dude, Moosey's trying. He's got three people on him. Dude, the giant beat him too. Oh, well, those guys are dead. Oh, dude, the soundtrack goes crazy. Okay, the entire group like caught up to them. Even our Lumpus is here, man. Don't let him shoot the bull. That guy is yelling out under the assumption that like several soldiers do not want to hurt an animal. Wow, he's finally doing something from the back of the bull, man. Both of them. I'm saying, Law. He put his brother's skin on, man. <laughs> the head shake. Wait, they were in the same block. Yeah, fused with his young brother, Bobby. The Funk Boys. They didn't last that long, did they? I don't even remember how they were eliminated. A shortcut to reach the... Wait, what? Huh? I mean, you found the shortcut. Oh, cool. Thanks, Funk Boys. I love how Luffy is less worried about even making it to Doflamingo and more worried about just beating Cavendish there. And I guess all the others. Oh, what the hell? He's like tricking them? Is he like leading them away? How could he trick them? That's what I said. Luffy's just gr like dragging Law there and he's going to be defenseless. It'll work itself out. <laughs> Dude, what could be his plan though? And why would he be working against him? Maybe I guess for the bounty? Like, he said he was saved by Usad. Oh my. It has to be for the bounty. Yeah, 100%. They, they it cut to law for a reason like law would see through this or at the very least be apprehensive to it oh finally they're not on moosey anymore they joined them along this entire time just for that bit so where does the tunnel actually take luffy oh no dude i actually thought why did i think they were gonna have some bigger part to play they actually just fell off who could be calling law <laughs> it's like a standard answer. They need to go there. Yeah, exactly what Law said. The plateau for the key. Law's going to hear this and be like, take me back right now. Bart's mm, face. <laughs> He's so excited to hear Luffy's voice. They're actually going to catch up to them and meet him at the sunflower field. Okay. Why is it leaking? What? This is straight up a trap, but why is it leaking? They got some... The airline! What, they're just gonna fly them there? No way, dude. Fly all of them? I guess they have, like, insane strength and inherently could. Hello? Hello? Oh my gosh, man! 
It was the longest pause of all time. I can feel myself. I feel myself getting older right now. He elongated that like 10 seconds. Yeah, they should have just won the bounty. But what happens in this tunnel is the question. No place to run. I mean, you already have, might have the right idea if there's, there's like water involved. I'm actually more shocked at Law, but I guess Law has no reason to like distrust anyone either. But like at the same time he does, cause like he knows that they have temporary bounties set on them. I don't know, man. Feels like it's just like a way to slow, slow Luffy down. Dude, I, I don't know why Cub is so funny to me, but he is. I never thought about that like that. Like the Tantanas are stupidly strong and they have an airline system. They could just pick them all up and fly them. It'd be super easy. I mean, they picked up that giant piranha fish and just carried it back effortlessly. <laughs> They're all matching, bro. <laughs> They're kind of cute. Cute little yellow beetles. Rooster Big Human. That's still Bart's nickname. What? What sound did Usopp just emit? What was that? What do you mean? Are you serious? What? Are they scared? Guys, when have the Tentatas ever led you astray? They just hold strings? You know how strong they are. What do you mean? They think they're just going to get up in the air and get dropped. Oh, big humans are too heavy. I mean, they wouldn't do it and, like, knowingly screw them over. Oh, they said they're too heavy, but if they work together, they're not. They're kind of, like, hovering. Oh, so it's just, like, a way for them to get down faster. <laughs> Dude, I love how just blank their faces are. Like, they're just happy to be there. They can't fight, but they can slow you down when you fall. Yeah, it's just a way faster way down. Like, a fast elevator. While also making distance. Look at them. They're flying. It's beautiful. Dude, he said they couldn't fly, but like they're straight up hovering without dropping much air. Were they able to actually get distance? They're they're definitely gonna beat Luffy now, because who God knows what trap he's just like walked into, wandered into. Oh my gosh, man! I totally forgot about Frankie and Senor Pink. Swim, swim. Look at him, dude. He's so hard boiled. It seems like he's kind of like messing with Frankie. Oh, bro, dude, he's bodying Frankie. I'm mean, here and he suplexed him. Dude, why is the, but his bulge was so pronounced. This is how men fight. Hot boiled. Come on, Frankie. Dude, how do you beat him? If you're around concrete, it's just GG. I think it's the first time I've heard him actually laugh. <laughs> Dude, wait, it says don't cry on his back. I never even realized that. <laughs> God. Oh, shoot. Wait, Frankie's got backup. I guess they need to help him to blow down the doors of the place. They got to take down Senor Pink. I'm surprised no more of the family was sent to the, the factory, man. And meanwhile, Zoro. I feel like Pika doesn't stand a chance against Zoro. <laughs> It's been a second since I heard his voice. Nah, yeah, I feel like Zoro's got him outmatched. Big ass dull sword. This is what I'm saying, man. He's obviously not primarily a swordsman and relies more on his devil fruit power usually. Dude, that's sick. Just like completely swaps to stone. Yeah, Pika doesn't win this fight without using his devil fruit. He's such a unit, man. It's like, is that his skin? Are the spikes part of his skin? Is this gonna be like some nothing? Like, is they're just gonna come back out? Like, there's no way Kelly Funk had this good of a plan. Oh. Is it Tontatas? Who else would have just like landed? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Just start going back the other way. Like, hello? Oh. Wait, it's straight up just a dead end? What? Oh no, Moosey's freaking out. Oh no, someone's coming in to trap them. Who could it be? Ah, uh, it looks like Doflamingo's hands. But it feel, I feel like it's going to be a fake out. I don't think Doflamingo would drop down and like, kill Kelly Fung. But his hand is like, like I said, it's like that. And it kind of, he's shaped like Doflamingo. I mean, this could be pretty disastrous if Doflamingo is actually in here. But I don't think he'd come down from his, his place. It is him! Oh my! 
my gosh! Bro, Kelly Funk working like uh, directly with Dolph Amigos was not my bingo card, man. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Papa's here. Dude, I take it back. I thought this was going to be a whole lot of nothing and just like waste time. But Dolph Amigo actually has them trapped. That's insane. 689. Dude, for like a split second, I was like, is it going to be like Kinemon in his Dolph Amigo attire? But I, I don't think he's wearing it anymore. He's still doing that walk, bro. Poor Moosey. He's probably so scared. Dolph Amigo wants to act before Law gets the handcuffs off. Yeah, he'd actually be scared of him. I'm shocked that Dolph Amigo's making a play like this. I, I did not think he would come down at all. I thought he would just wait. <laughs> Moosey! No! You bastard! Stop! No! No! He actually killed Mercy! You bastard! No, f no, Flamingo! No, this is not right! This is not right! Is that seawater? Choose him. Oh, the team up with? Mm. Oof. Saved. Oh my gosh. My brother. Yeah, Corazon. Yes. We got a little snippet of it. Dude, what was that like shot? What was that like the cut, that fade? What would stop Dolphamingo from killing him right here, right now? Being cocky? That has to be seawater. Luffy's like weak. No way! I take everything back. I take it all back. They're going to die, but they're going to waste this time. Oh, it's the clone. Ah, uh, so Dolph Amigo himself wouldn't actually come down. Dang, bro. I feel bad now. I totally forgot about Dolph Amigo's clone. Did they actually take it down by cutting it? Yo, guys, you've redeemed yourselves. I'm so sorry, man. Oh, hell yeah. Dude, is Moosey really dead? I'm going to be so sad, man. He deserves so much better. He carried them so far. Dude, there's so many like players in this game. I forget like Heroes is going there. Like, it's, it's hard to remember everything and everyone. Oh, there's a sniper. Are you sure you want to be a part of the family? Like, you really don't know what you're getting yourself into. What? Or did he just, oh. Oh, W, old man! Saving Kiros! Ah, Kiros gonna fly up there and save him. Mm-hmm. God damn! He's still not killing anyone. Like, he hit him with the, the blunt end. With the handle. What? 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 That's why he said foreign pirate? I won't let a foreign pirate do it? He wanted to do it? Oh my gosh, bruh. Shameless old man. He's like, yeah, he knows they're like being forced to inherently like try to. But like also at the same time, you know, it's still kind of messed up, man. He just, you know. Okay, so that clone is not very strong either. Unless it just repairs here. Brought down the big game. Oh my gosh. I guess, yeah. Mental. I mean, Doflamingo's always been one about like mental warfare, too. So they're the ones that like stabbed Kelly Funk? Or did Doflamingo's clone come down, stab him, and walk in, and then they came after him? Oh, yeah. Doflamingo flew in and just stabbed Kelly Funk. Dude, that's menacing, man. Hey, Rip Bozo. Hey. Rip Bozo. I guess Bozos. There's two in there. Moosey. A shorter route. What is he going to do? Oh, no. He's going to bust through. Hey, man, I'm all for it. If it means we get there faster. Everybody's just all converging on the same place. It's going to be chaos. Oh, wait. Kiros is right there. He's about to see it. Is he just going to punch upwards? Take them out one by one. Where's the G? Oh, there's no G. He poses like this. Bro, there's no way of splitting this entire plateau. <laughs> oh my gosh. Damn. That boy is thick. 
Oh my, dude, dude, I'm I'm so sick of these eye catchers, man. Listen, they're cute and all, but like it's the placement of them. It's strictly the placement. You do it right before the the fist, man. Come on, get it together. That's gotta be the biggest elephant gun we've ever seen. He's catching up. That's what he's doing. <laughs> I like how Shin Zhao's the only one that knows. Yeah. Dude. This guy is actually badass, though. His design and everything. So it's gonna be like, like Shin Zhao and all of them versus the family, I think. I think that's what's kind of built up towards. At least this section of the family. Dude, that is insane. It doesn't break a sweat, man. It's like, does Elephant Gun use, like, third gear in inherently? Yeah, right? Because it's like his giant fist. There's, like, no repercussion to it anymore at all. Like, r even remotely. It's it's insane. Since time skip. Like, him shrinking in his fight against Luchi was like, is such an insane downside. I feel like that that's inherently Luffy's biggest power spike in time skip, aside from hockey, was the fact that, like, how much power he can use without any repercussions. It's something I haven't even like really thought about or talked about. Because like hockey, it's so easy to be like, damn, armament. Because I think elephant gun is still my favorite move from Luffy. Just because of the way it looks. Armament hockey in general just looks just so badass, man. Oh my, oh my gosh, bro. Sabo's going to just destroy all of the rest for Sa. I actually don't know who comes out on top here. This is a crazy fight. I feel like Fujitora has to at the end of the day, especially because Sabo is still new to his devil fruit. So if I bet money, it'd be on Fujitora. Dude, it's so cool, man. Damn. These are just two absolute powerhouses. Oh, an opening. All his senses are elevated, being blind. Yeah. I mean, I underestimate Sabo because his Delphur is new, but he is number two, yeah. How does this end, though? One of them just, like, incapacitated? Like, dude, they're just gonna keep going. The Tentatas are gonna jump in! An idea to unlock the door? What? They don't really have to tell him to keep him busy. In fact, they shouldn't, because it just distracts Frankie. Dude! Dude, he's suplexing him again! Senor Pink is kind of him, man! Oh my gosh, they're just targets in the air. Not the Beatles! Rebecca's just like, damn, I'm just, I'm just cut meat, bro! He can't bury her without his hands. Yeah. Uh, okay, you could definitely cross your fingers. Dude, how are they missing them? Like, this horribly. What, taunt? He's gonna piss on them? <laughs> it's running away! No shot! Oh my god, Bart is just a, a wild card. The definition of a wild card. Sunflower, oh. Someone made it? Oh. Bellamy! What the hell? What is he doing? No way is bro, like, bro going up to like confront Del Flamingo. That would be a crazy character if like full circle moment. Oh shoot, he actually is. String Joker. Oh, lore, lore, lore. The day we met law. Oh, wasn't he like a child? Hmm. <laughs> I can't, bro. Trouble's face is so dumb. Like, Diamante is at least intimidating. Oh, lore! 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 Oh my god, he's got grenades strapped around them? Little law! Oh my gosh! White Town Flevens? Dude, young, younger Doflamingo, too. What is the White Town? Oh my gosh. Dude, it's getting loud. Oh, dude. 
Dude, them confronting each other is gonna be crazy. Like it, it got like deafeningly loud. Holy, I love these moments where we get to cut back to see like how things used to be with them too and how they met. Like, dude, this shot, this shot alone with just little law with grenades strapped to him. So I feel like this, like, it seemed like very important that he, he said he grew up in a, in, let's say, White Town Flevins? Grew up in the White Town Flevins. I don't think we've ever heard that name, but obviously him telling Doflamingo that is, like, substantial. Interesting, man. We get little bits here and there of lore, like, like I said, the, the string version of Doflamingo confronting law and, like, having this drop of, like, oh, like, how, how you were whenever I met you back then. And I think it's gonna slowly more, like, drip more and more and more leading up to this confrontation. But I just, I, I fiend for every drop of it knowing, like, the backstory and the history between between them but like i said every single passing episode like the entire group the entire cast sort of gets closer and closer and i feel like it's just gonna absolutely explode once everybody gets to the same spot and it's just gonna be all out war man like i said there's so many players in this game that's hard for me to remember all of them so whenever it cuts to like heroes so i'm like oh yeah we have that we have that to think about too it's a family to think about too and who knows what's even happening to sunny right now with nami and all of them like bro how long ago was it like a 15 16 episodes ago that they even happened maybe even long no it's, it's been even longer i think like 20 or 30 like at this point i'm just writing them off like goodbye rest in peace maybe because that's been it for my reaction today i hope you did enjoy make sure you leave a like on this one it does help me out quite a bit and i will catch you next time peace peace